Hello and welcome to the how to upload to Redbubble automatically and easy video. If you are on Redbubble, you know, you click here on add new work, then you can yeah, upload your new work or copy an existing one and you select your file and then you have to enter here your listing for different languages if necessary and also adjust here the products and of course do this one by one for every design. But this is of course a lot easier with Flying Upload and how I show you now. If you haven't downloaded Flying Upload already, you can do this on flyingresearch.net, link also in the description and then you can put in here your designs, write your listing and then set up the configuration for Redbubble to upload automatically. And it's also very easy. Simply go here to options, settings, and then here first to auto login, go here to Redbubble, enter your login data. It's all local, it's all encrypted, it's as safe as possible, so no worries. And the second step is you have to set up a template for Redbubble, so Flying Upload knows what to copy and what to use in case of resolution and also in case of products you want to have. This is also very simple. Go to Redbubble to your portfolio, then click here this little settings icon on the design you want to use, copy settings and then copy here this duplicate link. It's very simple and then go back to flying upload to your settings, paste it here and then also the red bar will be gone and simply hit save. And your Repubble is already set up and now you can upload automatically. And now we are at the upload step, also very simple. Go here to the upload section, everything is configured for Repubble, simply click start. Then the Chromium browser will open and first it will log in here. Um, often here a capture comes up, let's see. Yes, also in this case, and then simply solve it manually. And then after this flying upload will continue. Of course, you can also make it full screen. Here it is also possible at the first upload that uh, another capture comes up, yes. Also flying upload will bring you a message, click OK. Then a small window will open. The capture is often solved automatically like here and then close it click OK and from now on flying upload can continue automatically. So no matter if you upload 5, 20 or the allowed 60 per day designs, now it will go through and yeah, you can design, you can make research, you can drink a coffee, no matter what, this goes now automatically. So the new image will be uploaded, your listing data will be entered and then of course it will be also published by Flying Upload. So based on the designs you upload, you can save minutes till few hours per day with the Flying Upload process. And yeah, I hope you like this and I hope you also see the advantage. Try it, as I mentioned, link down in the description and then I hope it can help you. Here is some extra information I want to give you and this is that you can make your upload of course more individual. Sometimes you want to upload to white shirts, sometimes you want to upload to black shirts and so on. This is also possible with the settings and the templates of Redbubble because you have here down specific templates you can use. This is based on your options for your design. So you have it for men, women, youth. This is this line and also for the color black. So this one, if you have these settings, you can, for example, set here a specific template. And if you want to have one for white, you can go here. And this is, for example, one with white background. You copy your settings again. You copy the duplicate link again and then you can paste it here for men, women, youth in white. So if you want to set the settings like this, then it would be uploaded 
to this design here and you can do this for yeah different for all types here for all different colors here in uh in total you have 21 different template options you can use like you want and at last i want to show you some usually errors or configuration mistakes a user can make so it don't work no worries it's most of the times very very small things the most common issue is if you go to settings templates and Redbubble, and you set here a wrong template you can enter here basically everything that you want simply not the duplicate link flying upload needs then you go to the upload section and you can click of course on Redbubble. Um, it will open because it has a template it sees it but when it tries to yeah open this link and of course we uh, entered like AAA then the browser here will simply close and will try to restart and upload it again and this is like the most common error um, yeah simply this is always a wrong template you have configured here make sure it's a duplicate link you can also see here the um, example and if it's a duplicate link from your Redbubble account you log in it's usually no problem um, a second problem sometimes can happen if you start the upload um, please um, at least get the size the tool opens the chromium browser you can of course also make it full screen what you shouldn't do is minimize it because if you minimize it flying upload can't click anymore and it will stand still or get an error after two three minutes and retries and pops up again and so on so make sure um, yeah you have at least this size full screen is even better and of course background upload is possible so you can make your research or make designs whatever <laughs> watch a watch a series um, the only important thing is don't minimize it background upload is possible without problems and these are like the most common errors but as I said very very small things just keep that in mind and your upload will go smooth without problems